my dear student now hydrogen peroxide another compound of hydrogen that is h2o2 colorless liquid at the very pale blue its method of preparation number 1 is mox process when sodium peroxide is reacted with h2o4 20% dilute ice cold solution we will get of the h2o2 na2o2 with h2o4 h2o2 plus na2so4 the na2so4 get crystallized in on cooling as na2so4 dot 10h2 and decantated solution contains dilute h2o2 solution this na2so4 solution gets crystallized on cooling as na2so4 dan h2o na2so4 dot 10h2o and decantated solution contains decantated decantation you know that and it will give you dilute h2o2 solution and from the barium peroxide method this is second method barium peroxide method in this case the paste of the paste of barium paste of hydrated barium peroxide is prepared in ice cold 20% sulfuric acid is it clear and then third method is this is the hydrated barium peroxide hydrated barium peroxide we are getting then third by 10% solution of 2 ethyl anthraquinone in this process air is passed through 10% solution of this compound in mixture of benzene and alcohol containing 7 to 10 carbon atom of hydroxyl ion and in this way we will get the h2o2 2 ethyl anthraquinol 2 ethyl anthraquinol c2h5 this oh and ring is present all three and we are getting this compound o2 hydrogen palladium catalyst and two ethyl anthraquinone one we will get and we are getting 1% h2o2 aqueous h2o2 is recovered by extraction with water and by and by product is the reduced back by action of hydrogen palladium and used again and again now we can do some more reactions of the physical properties of the h2o2 now the physical properties of hydrogen peroxide it is blue salt bitter in taste diamagnetic it is more dense and viscous than water highly associated with hydrogen bond its melting point is 272.4 kelvin and boiling point is 358 kelvin its chemical properties on decomposition it will give you water and oxygen and it is acidic in nature it is weak acid and dissociate as h2o2 gives you h plus and h2 negative ion with alkali it gives corresponding peroxide h2o2 to to nh gives you na2o2 plus h2o and then third the important one is that oxidizing in nature h2o2 provide an atom of oxygen it is oxidizing agent as a nascent oxygen and repeatedly it act as an strong oxidizing agent in acidic strong oxidizing agent in acidic as well as basic medium in acidic as well as in basic medium in the next class we will discuss the oxidizing nature of the h2o2 good bye and uh, the next class is important because these reaction will come in the plus 2 also thank you